so I just did a review on the Kobe Kairos mid-712 a while ago like 45 minutes and I completely forgot some points that I wanted to make and if you should buy it or not first of all I'm going to make the point of certain games like Mind Builder which is a great game for Android and iOS um, it does seem to have some issues on it. Um, I still have version 1.9.2 on mine because I'm afraid if I download it to 1.9.4, it won't be able to handle it because look how long it's taking to load right now. Um, I die. That's great. And it seems my world on. See if you can see it takes a while for the spawn and stuff. And it's kind of laggy. I'm hoping it will get better over time because it was laggy on my phone originally. But now it doesn't lag at all on my phone. Um, another game, Apparatus. This game actually runs quite smoothly on my tablet. And since it's resistive, it's not multi touch. So, um, that makes it kind of hard sometimes for certain apps. I'm just gonna put that down and even try. I will. Anyway, and then. I already expressed that you could get certain things on it if you had the skills. And I'm just going to do a quick review of things I covered in the last one because of um, people who maybe watched this part but haven't watched the first one. I told about how it comes with gingerbread stock, 4 gigabytes internal memory, an SD card slot, a microphone, even though I couldn't get voice commands to work yet. Um, it comes with a Git jar market, but I have an Android market if you can just see right there. Um, I'm using ICS Launcher. Um, I reviewed videos and music on it. And I forgot to review the gallery on it. And we're going to use um, the picture for my Warrior X. Now, as you can see, it looks weird, but then it like renders itself down and looks good. We'll do another one. Um, this one you can't actually see that well but it's an actual picture of my tablet. Um, so overall I would recommend buying this tablet if you're going to use it for music and maybe not as complicated games and for videos too it's really good for videos um it's a pretty good tablet for a hundred dollars honestly if i could have this or the hundred dollars that was paid for it i'd rather have this by far um since it's an android you, you can pretty much do anything to it and it's just a great tablet and my only advice is if you get this if you have problems with it PM me because Kobe support is terrible I was on hold with them for 50 minutes and all they told me to do was reset my tablet like um hard reset it and that's another thing I forgot it actually has a reset button at the bottom which just pretty much reboots it um, that's pretty much it so if you like watching videos or listening to music or playing apparatus or just mobile photo gallery get this tablet 
you're more into gaming, I would recommend a Galaxy tablet or the Arcos.